Hey everybody, it's Phil with Behringer. How you doing today? Welcome to Music Group TV. I want to talk to you today about some cool connection features with the X-Air products. So today we're going to talk about Ultranet. And Ultranet is a way to get 16 channels from our mixer downstream to an item like a P16 or a Behringer product that uses the Ultranet technology. And I can use it here or even on some turbo sound speakers using the acoustic integration feature. So it's a very hip setup. Let me get into it a little bit more so you'll know what I'm talking about. If you're on stage and there's a person mixing the sound for the audience, you're gonna to wanna to be able to monitor what's happening on stage so that you can hear yourself clearly and perform very well. And typically that's done with in-ears or with a floor wedge. And you can get sound brought back to you and you can monitor it like a personal monitoring system. What Ultranet allows you to do is everybody on stage can get the same 16 channels, yet each person that has a P16 can design their own mix. And that's really handy because not everybody wants the same thing on a stage. Some people want more of the vocalist, some people want more kick drum, more guitar, whatever it is, you can accomplish this here. So for instance, right now I have a session basically playing that's emulating a live band on stage. And you can see right here these green lights lighting up. And what these are, are these are actual channels that would be coming to me on stage from a mix. And so, and this, what's hip is that it's completely independent of the front of house mix. There's nothing I can do that's gonna mess up the house mix or anybody else's mix on stage. Even if the front of house engineer is using the aux outs to send different mixes out, this is completely independent of that. And it's great because it's your mix. You customize it yourself, it works for you, you perform better, you're happier, it's a great show. Super cool. So, <laughs> what I wanna talk about is on the screen, how to kind of route this. And on the routing page, you can see I have USB outputs and P16 outputs. So what this does is I can create each one of these channels that I want to send out. Right now, I just have all the channels going one to one, two to two, three to three, and so forth. But I can have the channels going, or I can send the effects down there, or I can have the USB outputs coming back. Or for instance, if I was using playback tracks, I could have a two mix of the playback music coming in or a click track as well as the live microphones and they're independent of each other. So now that we get the idea that I can get 16 channels coming to me and I can create my own mix, let's talk about the specifics of where I get that signal from. So the choices I have on screen you can see is I get to pull the signal that I want basically away from everybody else. So by that I mean I can take just from the analog input or the analog plus the mute or I can choose from a microphone input, a USB input, I can choose the signal to come from pre-EQ, what the sound guy does for EQ, or I can make it post-EQ, I can make a pre-fader or post-fader, and why all of these have input plus mute or pre-EQ plus mute, or not, is what that means is if the front of house engineer who's mixing the sound, if they mute the front sound, is that gonna affect me or not? And that can be cool or it can be something that I may not want. So for instance, if I choose this and I say, you know what, I want this to be analog plus mute. Now if I go over to channel one and I mute it, you see there's no signal happening over here anymore. It's gone away. Whereas on the next channel, which is not set up that way, if I hit mute, it stays on. So I get to choose, because sometimes you may want to go, if, it's, if the sound engineer wants to mute it, fine, mute me too. Or you can say, you know what, I want to stay independent of that, and I can go ahead and go back and just choose the input. And that way I'll always get the sound. So this is just a little bit about the P16 unit and the Ultranet technology that we're using, and I hope you've gained a couple little tidbits of information. Thanks for watching Music Group TV.